Hey guys, Fingercraft here, and today we're going to be going over the uh, next collection of my McDonald's toys. This is probably going to be the final video for the McDonald's toys, because I found all that I could find that I own. So, up first we have one that I've never opened since I've got it. This is the very first toy to the Super Mario Brothers movie. I didn't get a chance to collect these, I lost my chance. But I am going to later on purchase all the whole entire set off of eBay and then go over them. Because I do want to get this set. But our first one that we have from that uh, movie is the Mario. And it's basically like a jumping Mario. Looks like he, you know, jumps out of the tube. But, uh, yeah. And I'm trying to... 2000 and 2022 right there. This is 2022. Nintendo. Is Wendy's came in. McDonald's and. Born in 2023. That's weird. <laughs> but it is what it is. And then we have another one here. That I haven't never opened. This is a. um One of the Sonics. From the. Uh, second Sonic movie. Yeah Sonic 2. It's toy three. So this is number three. I didn't collect all of these. Let me see if I can find the date when these came out. Which I'm looking for right now. And I'm not seeing the date on the back of the bag. So. Well, that's weird. Oh there it is right there. It's hard to see. 2021. So that's Toy 3. And then we also have another Sonic toy that I've never opened. This one's toy number 1. And this is the uh, other Sonic that runs. But we have that one. And then the last one that I have of Sonic, this one is open. Because this was given to me by a friend. And um. This is the Goad Sonic. I'm not sure what number he was. But yeah I've got the Goad Sonic. Which it. Okay you just pull him back. And he, he goes. <laughs> That's how that works. So we got him. And the next one that we have, I've only got two. Uh, I know I collected the whole thing, but I could only find two pieces. I have the light. Which, how does this thing work? The button's back here. It's dead. But I have the light. And I've got the morph spoon. But these are the Treasure Planet McDonald's toys that you could collect. And when you collected all the pieces... You could actually combine them together to form that uh, the the ball that had the map in it. You could actually collect them all and form them together. There's about I think eight of these, but I've only got these two. I can't find the rest of it for right now. But if I ever find the rest of it later on, we'll go over it again later on in a future video. But for right now, I can't recover the rest of it. But I've got that. I've got a um. Another Star Wars little McDonald's toy. This is the thing like here where you just you grab this back here, you press these in, and when you press these in, the vehicle goes flying. Because it releases when you press. See what it releases? And then this thing right here just snaps into the back. So when you press that in, it releases and the spring activates. So we'll do it one more time. But yeah. That looks like a Obi-Wan's uh, ship. Which I, I think it is Obi-Wan. Let me see here. Does it tell me? And it doesn't really, does it? I think it's Obi-Wan's. Because I think Anakin had the yellow one. 
The next one that we have to go over is a very, very old one. We have um, Shane from Mulan. This is a half Shane. He used to have a Mushu little uh, rocket that went in here. You just press it in there, it would shoot. I lost the rocket, but I still have the figure. He's got a uh, ball little uh, marble here at the bottom of him where he can, you know, move. But yeah, we have um, Shane from Mulan. And he came out... Gosh, when did you come out? Does it even say your date? It just says McDonald's Corp made in McDonald's, Disney. You can see there it says McDonald's. China Corp. Uh, but I don't see no... I don't see no release date. This may be before they started printing the release dates on the toys. Because, yeah, he don't have one. Well, that sucks. I don't, I don't know when he came out. But he came out years ago. Let's put it that way. And then our next one that we have is a uh, another Shane. And he's the one where you would basically press his legs right here. And he would do like... Almost like a karate chopping, but he's he's not exactly um working right. He's um he's wore out. You see his his arm is loose. Yeah, he would basically do like a karate chop like that every time you would move his legs. But you can see there there's um Shane. Yeah, he was my favorite character on Mulan. I always thought he was cool. Yeah, when it came to uh, Shane, he was my favorite character on there. <laughs> and it says McDonald's Corp. For McDonald's Corp. Where is your release date, buddy? It don't look like he has a release date neither. But it says McDonald's Corp right there. On his back right here. And then right here on his leg. It says about the same thing. Disney. But I'm not seeing a release date. So, yeah, these are before they started doing the release dates. But you can see here, the, these are some very, very old figures. They was made back then when Mulan was in theaters. But you got them. The next one that we have is um, a um, big old f uh, fat uh, puss in boots. <laughs> he would normally talk, but he's probably dead. You would basically... You know, like, you, it was weird, but you basically pet him, and he would say, Do I know you? Do I know you? And then he would eventually go, Row! I remember that's what he would say, but he's, yeah, he's dead. His batteries just went out. And, like I said, with McDonald's, you gotta have the triangle screwdriver to get in there to change the batteries. But, yeah, we got a, uh, a very big old fat, Puss in Boots. <laughs> uh, his release date. He's got it right here at the bottom of his belly. Let me try zooming this in. I think it says 2010. You can see it right there. 2010. McDonald's. Yeah, this one came out in 2010 from the looks of it. We have him. I'll get the wings back on this thing and get this over here because I got two of them. Here's one and here's two. We have Toothless and we have this one. Which I think this is the girl and her dragon. Get off a of spider web. But yeah, it's got these wings that you would have to clip on when you get it out of the bag. And um, if it works, which it probably don't, that would spark, because it's, it's built with a spark inside. Which. Yeah, I'm thinking the spark is dead. Yeah, the sparks are dead. It would spark, like, uh fire inside because it's got like a uh, like a striking thing in there that creates sparks but it, it's not working but you can see there there's the uh the goal riding the dragon 
These came out. It's right here on his belly. If it's got the date. I just see right now McDonald. Okay, there it is right there. 2000 and. That looks like another 2010. Yeah, that's another 2010. But we have her. And then after her, we have Toothless. When I'm guessing this is when he was wild because he doesn't have. Yeah, he's got his tail still yet. Of course, you know, when they first found him, he didn't have a piece of his tail. But he's got his full tail. He's got um, no saddle on him. So this is him when he was wild. But basically, you basically squeeze his back legs right here. Or one of them. You'd pull this one down. And then that would activate his wing flapping. And, yeah, he's the same way as the uh, other one. Which I'm trying to look and see. He's a McDonald's toy because he has the, the triangle screws. He's got some kind of a weird thing written down here on his tail. What is that, D17? What's that for? <laughs> I don't know. Um... He's all dusty. Where did they imprint the logo on you? Huh. That's weird. <laughs> That's where his wings would snap in. I'm looking for his logo. Maybe it's on his wings? Oh. It's on his belly. It's just very, very hard to see. You can see it right there. It's engraved in his scales. Yeah, 2010 right there. Right where the screw is right here. 2010. That is really well hidden. I didn't even see that at first. But yeah, he was toothless. You can see I'm just pulling this leg down. That operates it. But yeah, we got um, we got her and we got Toothless. Those are the only two that I've collected from the How to Train Your Dragon. Uh, what is this thing? Uh, what are you? <laughs> I'm not sure what this is, but I know it's a McDonald's toy because it has the, the triangle screws, but I don't know what this is. I can't remember for the life of me what this thing is. Maybe it came from that one movie, uh, the, the Pacific Rim or something like that. I just, I don't know. <laughs> it's some kind of bird. And it's dead. I tried turning it on. It won't do nothing. But yeah, we have some kind of a, uh, some kind of a red bird. I don't know what it is. <laughs> and then our next one that we have to go over is, um, The Incredibles car. <sighs> So we got the Incredibles car. Which I'm trying to remember what this thing does. What do you do? These are like these can be pressed. Maybe not. Huh. Maybe it's just not working. I remember this car done something. These feel loose right here, too, at the front. I don't want to end up breaking anything, because I can't remember what a toy does. <laughs> oh, well. Let me see here. These look like these pull out. But they're jammed. You can see they pull out. <laughs> they're jammed. Oh, when I did that, this came... Oh, okay. I got one side out. But this side over here is jammed. What's jamming you? Come on. There we go. Okay, so apparently that's what it does. Probably did that wrong, but you know. And then you just click those back in place. 
You can see Mr. Incredible sitting in the car. And he came out. Of course, they're not going to tell the date. This says McDonald's Corp Company and all that, but there ain't no date for the release. So yeah, this is another one before they started printing the dates on the toys. But we have that one. Our next one that we have are some uh, two Pokemon. We have this one. Which looks like he's looks like he's seen better days over here. <laughs> yeah, there's um all the names. McDonald's Corp and all that. 2011. This one came out 2011. I can see it right there. But yeah, we got um him. And then we have this one. Turn him on. I think he would light up. I think he would light up red when you press on his back legs. Oh, he worked a little bit. You can see the light's still working a bit. Let me turn off this light. He still works. You can see when I press down on him on his back legs, that comes on red. So that one actually still works. That's surprising. Anyway, we'll turn him back off. Here, right here on this side is where they uh, imprinted the McDonald's logo. But yeah, we have two Pokemon from McDonald's. Looks like, you know, a rat got a hold of him right here and chewed on his ear. Stupid rat. I hate those things. But yeah, you got uh, those two Pokemon. Now, uh... I'm missing one of these. Before I go over those, I will show this thing. There was uh, somebody on my YouTube that asked me to go over the whole entire Skylander Swap Force toys. Unfortunately, the only one that I have collected is the Chompy. But uh, I have found the whole entire set on eBay for about 40 something dollars. Once I get the money, I will order that and then we'll go over those toys in a future video. I'll keep it in mind for a future video. But the only one that I have collected is this little... Chompy thing. That's very addicting. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's a very addicting little toy. See? And then if you just do like I did, just fast shake it. <laughs> I'm sorry. I have too much fun with these things. But all of its stuff is imprinted right here on its side. Let me see if I can pick up any of that. I can pick up Activision. There's the McDonald's. But. Where is the. Oh there it is right there. I can do 2014. It says 2014. But yeah that's a little chompy. <laughs> I'm sorry y'all. And I'll get the next ones. Hang on here a minute. These are some really, really, really old ones. These most likely do not have their date imprinted on them. I'm missing one, though. I could not find the Cyclonus. And they are missing some pieces. But these are the Transformers from Transformers Armada. I grew up when I was a kid with Transformers Armada. That was my first Transformers. I didn't get to see any of Generation 1. But we got Red Alert. And I'll try to remember how to transform him. I think if I remember correctly, you turn... You turn his head. I got plenty of Transformers to go over too for future videos. You pull these doors up. You pull these legs down. And then you would move this chest piece down inside. And there you have Red Alert. Let 
But, um, yeah, there's this Autobot symbol. I'm looking all over this toy to see if there's um, any writing that indicates, you know, when it came out. But, like I said, this is... Yeah, this is before they started printing anything on them. They don't even have the McDonald's logo. But I know for a fact this thing came from McDonald's. This was their McDonald's Transformers or Moditories. Oh, I spoke too soon. It's in there. It's going to be hard to see because it's dusty. But the name of it is inside there right where the screw is right here. I can see it. I'll look for it on a, another one because I just can't see in there. Yeah, it just says McDonald's Corp and all that, but it is in there. But I'll look on the other ones for another uh, name because we got many others. Let's go over Megatron next. We got Megatron. I'm missing his cannon. He doesn't have his uh, army tank cannon. And there's his face. So to transform him, you would pull this right here down. And I think you would spin it. Yep, you would spin it. And then these could pull out and go in. So I'm thinking you push that in for his feet. And then you would pull these down. Like that, you would pull those down. Then you would pull that down. And then that down. What is that? Hey, I'm here, y'all. I spotted something inside the Megatron when I did that. Looks like a daggone. That better not be a spider's nest. I will throw this thing. <laughs> no, it's an old dried up stick. That was lodged in his arm but anyway there you go right there there's um yeah those don't pull out there's a megatron and like i said i'm missing his gun but uh, let me look on him see where it's right why do they make that so hard to see oh it does have a date 2002 2002 right there you can see it in his green and there's McDonald's. These came out in 2002. But yeah, there's Megatron. Next up, we'll go over Demolisher. He had a thing right here where when you would press this, his uh, gun arm would go flying off. I lost the gun arm. But if I remember correctly, these would slide forward, I think. Or would they just come down? I'm trying to think. Yeah, I'm right. They would slide forward. Slide that forward. Then you would bring this down. You would fold this up for his feet. Just like that. You would bring this down for his arm. You would do the other one too, but I lost the other one. And then you would pull his head up. And there's Demolisher. He does have the green eyes. It's just very hard to see it. You can see he's got a little bit of green in there. But there is Demolisher. The uh, Decepticon. And you would press that right there. And then his arm would go flying off. But there's Demolisher. Our next one that we have is Starscream. This one's basically like a quick transformer. He would basically uh, roll forward and then flip on his feet. I don't know if we can get him to do it. Yeah, he's not going to do it. But, whoa, <laughs> now you do it. But anyway, um, 
he would basically roll forward, and then this would basically flip, and then he would basically flip on his feet if it worked right. And then when he flips on his feet, you would have star screen. There's his McDonald's logo. Got some little old um. Yeah, trying to find it in the camera. There. Like some foam. Yeah, there's star screen. And then our next one that we have is um, Smoke Scream. He's another one. He's missing his crane. You would basically press this right here at the front. And then it would release the crane. But he would do a thing to where you would pull these apart. They're jammed. Go figure that they would be jammed. Okay, there's one. I'm not going to pull that too far because I don't want to break it. But I know they can go farther, but the screws are so rusted that they're not allowing it to go too far. And then you would pull this down for his feet. He would basically tilt the chest down like this, and then you would spin his head around. And right there is smoke screen. And then our last one, well, no, not last one, two more. My bad, two more. Our next one is Hot Shot. So this one, you would pull this. You would flip these around. Same thing, pull this, flip these around. And then you would pull this down, pull that down. Split these apart. You would pull these down. The bumpers for his feet. Then when you turn it around. You have this much. Then you can see his hands right there. Underneath the doors. Then you would lift up. Well, what was that? Things right here. Yeah. You would lift this up. And there's his head. So yeah, I'm doing it. Ah. Hey, I'm it. I'm doing good. I just dumped a thing of toothpicks. I'll pick them up in a minute. Didn't lose too many. But, uh, let me jump, get back to trying to figure out this dude. Uh, did these turn? Did these turn? No. Okay, the arms. The arms. So, yeah. Turn these arms. Turn these arms. They don't really, you know, work too good. But, yeah, you would see there. Probably go down like this. You would see there. His arms are there. He's right there. There's his face. There's Hot Shot. And then our last one, which is my favorite one. I am an Optimus Prime fan. In case you all don't know, Optimus Prime is my favorite Transformer. But the last one is um, you would pull these two down. You would basically pull these out. You would fold these smokestack looking things up. And they would create a hands you would pull the grill back and then you would pull the head forward and there is optimus prime and he also had um this button right here which um i think it operated his arm if it still works which it it is loose so yeah it's not basically you would pull on that and then his arm would go like that every time you would pull this lever down but it's not doing it and that's also his autobot symbol but yeah and there is the whole entire well not whole entire because i'm still missing smoke scream i got him somewhere i just don't know where he is at the moment but if i ever find him you know later i'll go over these again but let me just get all these set up okay but here is all the ones I've found so far. But yeah, that's going to do it for this uh, video of this McDonald's Toys uh, update. You all have a blessed one. And when I come back, we'll be going over some more figures. I'm not sure what we'll be going over yet, but we'll be going over something. But until then, you all have a blessed one. Goodbye.